and uh, it has a uh, I think 87 horsepower which is it's pretty uh, it's fairly impressive I mean it's no sport bike but this bike is actually what helped this is what started the whole sport bike era this bike but when you know when they first made it back in the 80s you can see it's a very similar seating my 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 feet are behind my knees it's a fairly aggressive stance although the handlebars aren't that low and even back in the I mean back in the day this was a fast bike now it's it's still pretty quick what I love about it is how it's so so smooth everything about it and this is the type of this type of bike you hop on and you go and you go and press the starter button again after it's already been running and you hear it grind and it makes you cringe because you're like oh the bike's already on it's just quiet and smooth i love it it's like when electric bikes pretty close to what it's going to feel like when you're riding an electric bike you just sneak in and out of places it is a uh, it does have six speeds I mean, I'm, I'm cruising at 65 in fifth gear. It's smooth. It feels great. Um, it's got plenty of power. It's at 60 miles an hour. It's only at it's less than 3,000 RPMs, 2,800 RPMs. Guys, this is a great, great bike. It's so much fun to ride. And there, you know, it's it's definitely unique. It's definitely a conversational piece. There's not, there's probably not going to be too many of them out there. And everyone's going to look at this and be like, "Hey, what is that? 1985? I had one like that when I was a kid." And you're like, "Nope, 2014. It's better." Whoa, 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 whoa! <clears throat> Come on, guy. Straight up, almost killed me. I'll forgive you, trucker. Almost killed me. Did you guys see that? <laughs> I went off the road. Oh well. <laughs> 